Hi guys, um, going to do a little bit of uh, projects today. Um, in this video, we're going to make um, altered puzzle piece paper clips. Uh, I'm working on a new journal, and I need uh, I wanted to work uh, create a few pieces. So I created one, um, but I forgot to put this on first. Um, so uh, that tip number one, make sure you adhere your paper clip first, because um, now I have to wait for my um, my uh, Nuvo drops to dry. But this is the one I created, and it's got a little uh, bulb pen with some beads and a button and a key on it. And then um, I I put um, uh, which that's a little long. I put some uh, cheesecloth on there. Where's my scissors? And then a little bit of lace, um, and uh, then a little flower, at, and I put uh, the Nouveau drops on there. So that one's drying. Um, and then when I when it's done drying, and there goes the mail. Hopefully the dogs won't bark. Shh, shh, guys, guys, shh, shush, shush, shh, shh, shh. Sorry about that. Um, then I'm gonna hear this on, and then. Uh, but I, we're going to cover that up. It's going to be a hidden paper clip. Um, so that's what we're going to do today. Um, so I, what I did to prepare the puzzle pieces, I just put a light coat of uh, white gesso on there. Well, first I, I gave it a little bit of sanding. And then I put a little bit of white gesso on there because I don't know what I'm going to put on it. If I put paper, it might show through or whatnot. Um, this one, um, all I did was stamp in the background um, with my new um, text stamp. So I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep that going um, and just stamp these. And I'm using my Stays On Temper Brown for this. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and start there. Let's see. Um, so, yeah, I am... Uh, I'm back now. I'm doing. I'm doing well. So, um, more videos, and I'm going to be going live this coming weekend. Um, I've missed you all uh, terribly. Um, yeah. So I'm just putting a little bit of stamping back here because even if I end up covering it up, then I cover it up. But at least there's something back here. So. That's that. That's all there is to that. So I hope you guys are well. It's it's Monday. I'm recording this on Monday. Um, I don't know if I'm going to publish it today or tomorrow. I might publish this one today um, because I didn't get you guys a video last week. I had doctor's appointments and all kinds of stuff going on. Okay, so before I get too far, I want to um, adhere my paper clip. Now this one, I'm going to totally hide it. Right? It's going to be put right there and I'm going to totally hide it. And then this one, it's a little, um, I could put it over here and so then it goes like that, but because um, it's too long to go this way unless you want it sticking out. But what I thought is, is I could still get it in the middle and instead of attaching a, a, a jump ring to it, it already will have the, the thing. So... And whichever way you're going to put it, make sure your little one is uh, the little side. I think will be better to, even though you're hiding it, to stick up instead of sticking down. Um, yeah, so I think I'm going to do that. Oops, that's upside down. We have to put it this way. So I think I'm going to, I think I am going to let that hang down right there. So let's go ahead and glue that one that way. And I'm going to use my um, quick glue. Um, let's see here. I don't want to glue the upper piece. I don't know what I'm doing. This was inspired by, this is a, a Pinterest, no, a Instagram inspiration, a journals by Karen. She'd had different aesthetics and stuff like that, but I was inspired by um, her. So, oh, and we're going to need some paper to hide it, right? So, I'm just going to put, where is, I'm going to put some regular cards, um, 
Yeah, I think I'm going to put some regular cardstock. So, um, let me, again, I have no idea what I'm doing, but, you know, this is what happens when you experiment. Uh, but, uh, she, you know, she just put her post on Pinterest, or uh, Pinterest, Instagram, and I've seen it, and, um, it inspired me. Again, hers are different than mine. Um, okay, so I want it to be, I want the paper. Ah, there we go. So, it needs to go down that way. So I think I need to actually be a little bit longer. Oh, let's see. Just cut it down. That's better. Okay, so I'm going to cut off that little piece I folded. Um, no, it's still not long enough. Because it's not going to work that way. I folded the piece the wrong way. Okay, let's do it. Do this one. Hopefully, this one will be long enough. Yeah. Okay. Cut it down a little bit. And still need to cut down some. And then right about there is our cutoff. All right. Looking good. Okay, that's a little bit better. And then I'm going to, I want it, I don't want it to show, so I'm going to cut this off. Hopefully that should be enough. Okay, perfect. And then, okay, and I think let's move that. Right, 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 right. Okay, I need another piece this size. This one, maybe? Hmm, it might actually get a little skinnier should be fine. Okay. Uh, even that up. Even that up. Okay. So then, put it on there. And that's going to get glued down. And I want that to hang down, so that's fine. Oops, is it too much? It is too much. Okay. You just got to play with it, I guess. You know, there we go. Okay, so that one right there. Make sure that the opening is pointing where you want it to point. In this case, this is going to be my bottom, so I want it to open there. All right, so that's good. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and glue that down. I'm going to, well, I got to... Oh, my goodness. Come on. Well, I'll be darned. Still, let's cooperate. Come on. It's been a week or a couple days since it was used. Okay, that should do it. There we go. Open her up. Okay, let's just I'm put some a bit of not globby, but um, a good amount of glue there. And this down to where it's just just below the upper part. Straighten it out. And this is metal, so I hope the art glitter glue is going to hold it. I'm just going to push down for a minute. Give it a second to set. Okay. Good, good. Make sure that 
So okay. Good. Setting good. All right. All right. Then now we need the other piece to hide. So I got that one. It's going to go in there. So I just need another piece here. Hmm. Right? Right. Yeah. I don't need this whole thing. Let's just chop that off. And I still need to go a little bit. And that'll hide that. Okay. I hope I'm doing this right. I have no idea. I'm just going to put glue all over this. Come on. There we go. Let's hope that this works. No guarantees. Cross your fingers and your toes here, people. Cross your fingers and your toes. I don't know if I should have made my pieces wider or whatnot, but I'm going to stick it down. Give it some good pressure. Okay. Good. Looks like it's working. Looks like it's working. All right. Yes. Okay. I think it is. Yep. Yep. It's working fabulously. Okay. Now, let's pretend that this is our page. Give it another good second. And voila. Yep. And then we can dangle some stuff down there. Mm -hmm. Okay, give that a second. All right, now this one is going to be totally hidden. I'm not going to leave it out. Uh, hmm. I wonder if I should try to put and then just cut around it. Kind of mm, it's kind of big. Maybe we can put a smaller paper clip on this. Let me see. Let's see. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to go with the smaller paper clip. I really wanted the big one, but I think. Um, yeah, I think this will work. So, and actually, I don't think I need to, I think I just need, well, no. I wonder if I could just get away with two pieces, one on top, one on the bottom. Let's try that. Let's see. Okay. Talking it out loud, guys. Talking it out loud. All right. So, let's cut this down a little bit. need something for it to glue onto there, so I don't want to cut it too much. Okay. All right. So, all right, let's do that. Clog my glue here. Don't know. Again, total experiment. But 
and again, this was inspired by an int uh, uh, Instagram post, but you know there wasn't any instructions or anything. So, and I kind of want to do it my way anyway, or you know I don't want to copy, but I want to be inspired by. So, give that some firm press down there, and then almost perfect length. Hmm. Yeah, I think I could get away with just putting two pieces on there. Let's try that. Don't want to let's see here. Put that down and cut it down right about there. Which is still too long. A little bit. A little bit. Move it up. Try to make it a little bit straight. Okay. I think I do need to put the um, because you don't want I don't want to put glue on there and then on the paper clip because then it's going to stick to the back paper and we don't want that. So I'm going to go ahead and fold it here. Okay, so that's fine. And then you can always do it this way. So then, yep, just make it a little bit skinnier. And we will be good to go. Trial and error. Should I make it shorter? Let's make it a little shorter. Let's do that like that. Okay, let's glue this again. Just don't have the hand strength, and I think this has got a it's got a, a glue bugger in there that doesn't want to come out. And you could put something on the back of these. Um, so, you know, do something decorative there if you wanted. I'm not going to at this time. Practically perfect. Hello. Come on. Okay, completely hidden. Let's make sure that we work. Okay. Good. Okay, let that one set another minute. Let's retest this one, make sure that uh, we're still good to go. Yep. And then it'll stick on the page. Okay, so this one's ready to decorate. All right, so on this one, do a little bit different because we already we got the dangle. We will do some dangling there. Um, let's see. Why is this not? Oh, I like the way I did the back on that one than on this one. But yeah, and I made two because my dirty fingers. Um, I want them kind of rustic too, so I'm okay with that. Um, all right, let's do, let's first put down some cheesecloth. I had a piece here somewhere. Here. And 
This is my new favorite cheesecloth. It's um, natural tone cheesecloth, and I love it. Um, this perfect color, and I can still color it if I want to. Um, yeah, I just, I just like it. Thank you, Giggs. You rock, girlfriend. Okay. And I can, I can fray that more later. So that's that. Let's start with that. And then, let's see, let's put some lace on here. And I already did blue. Let's, um, let's see, let's do a green one maybe. Green, a little bit of green. All right. Hmm. I got an idea. Two different lengths. Let's do that. And then let's do it like it's a, a ribbon. Yep, 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 yep. Like that. So we'll glue that down. And then um, we will. Let's, um, I brought out some of my blingy stuff. I don't, I want, um, I want to put on some of these things. Maybe one of these. Oh, that'll be pretty. Okay, one of those, and then, hmm, let's put, see what else I got in this bag. Anything in there? Yeah, but not what I want. Some more roses. Should we just put some some bling on there? There is. Oh, what's? I have my other bling too. I should pull out. Um. You know what? Maybe we'll put um. That there, yeah, and then um, oh, I used green, and that's not going to work. I'll have to get a different Nuvo drops. Um, yeah, we'll put this like this as a bow or a ribbon on there, like that, and then okay, and then. Okay, so we're gonna do that. Let's um, we use I'm gonna use my um Fabri-Tac because I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, put that down right there. And then, okay, I'm going to put this on there, it's a little, uh, like, cabochon rose, or, um, like, you know, it's just a plastic rose piece. We'll put that there, hold that there for a second, and we're good to go on that. Let's see if there's anywhere else we want to dab some glue. And I put very little on there because I don't want it to soak through and be all gaudy. Okay, let me see what pearl drops I have to go with this. If I have anything in the green range or something like that. Yeah.
Okay, I have this one. Sorry about that. Let's see. I have this one is called uh, Pale Gold. So, let's see. Do I like that? Oh, yeah. Do as I. I'm going to take that. It uh, did not do it well. There we go. A little more on there three is good okay so then we have our little our little part sticking out down there so let's deal with that so what I uh, what I did on this one if you don't have your paper clip hanging down you can um, use uh, I used my crocodile and I put a little hole in the, the, the little piece and then I did my dangly so that's how I did that one on this one, since we already have the paper clip hanging down and it's kind of hidden by all the stuff I put on there, um, let's just go ahead and put something on there. Um, get out a bulb clip. I love these things. I need to get some more because I'm going to go up. I'm going to lose. I'm going to end up using all of these. So then, let's see, I put a key on that one. So let's see, what else do I have in here? Um, where's my, there we go. Let's see here. Let's see what else I have? That's a D, I think. I'm not doing a B journal, so that's probably not what I want to go with. Um, what's that? What is that one? Oh, a little clover. Oh, that would look nice. Okay, so let's do that. And then as far as these, let's see, I think I have some green ones over here. I usually like to put at least three beads, work in odd numbers, and then we can put a button on it. Okay. And let's see. I should have a button in here that will go. Something you know, lightish green tone, I'm thinking. It's a little too olive, I think. Mm, yeah, too olive. Maybe I'll just put... Um, I know I should have some green ones in here. They might all be the wrong color. Take off my glasses. Let's see. Mm. Oh, here, this one. This one. Oh, don't lose it. Ah, where did they go? Now I want that one. Isn't that always the way? Where are you? Okay, I'm going to be right back and find my button. Okay, I found the button. And I don't know, you guys, let me see. Let me put my balls back on and see if you guys are seeing this well. I think so. Um, maybe I need to come down a little bit. Um, oh, I've had I'll focus on. Oh, I'm, gosh, I hope this recording is okay. Boy, did not check that. Okay. Um, so I found the button that I wanted. This was the one that I wanted. It's got some, some little specks in it. So I think that's going to go on there with that, right? But then I thought that I might put a couple buttons on there to kind of fill it in because it is a big, it is a big, um, puzzle piece. And so let's put this together. All I do is put one bead on and then I have probably... Uh, put the button next, and then the little 
charm if you're putting on a charm. Yeah. Charm is very bright. It's uh, a little on the silver side, but I kind of kind of like it. So I think I'm going to leave it. I'll just put on my other two beads. Okay, and then let's, um, yeah, because see, I think that just, I think without it, I think with it, it's going to look good. So let, uh, let's put this on. Oh, yeah, it should work without the bead. Note to self, I always get in a hurry and put my, my, um, that's backwards. Gosh darn it. My Nouveau drops on too soon. Let me put this back together here. Make sure I got everything right. Okay. Yep. So this is the way it needs to go. Put this on there. Don't drop it this time. Okay. Safety pin it. There we go. Turn it back right side. Come on. There we go. Oh, yes. Oh, that's cute. Okay. So I've got that on there. And I think I am going to put these buttons um, on there. I think it just, it'll add to it. Maybe it's a little bit overdone, but I think it needs something to fill it in. Uh, just, I just do. And I think this will be cute. Normally, I would sew um, just thread on the button. Um, and um, before I glued it onto anything, but I'm not taking the, I'm not going to take the time to do that today. It'll be fine. It's just a uh, paper clip embellishment, so I'll have to do, well, I'll have to do another session of these. Cause these are fun. This is, this is awesome. Um, I like these. I'll have to do more of these um, in a mass make um, for future journals. But isn't that, see, isn't that cute? Whoops. Yeah, I think so. Let me put focus on maybe you guys can use that too. Okay, so there you go. It's got the little beads, the lace. Yeah, okay. So I like that one too. So that's that's one that's like that one. Now if this one I want to do a little bit different. Um, let's see. What, what, how do I want to do... Um, I want to put a butterfly on this one, I think, and um, my kit, I, have, I think I have a butterfly I can cut out and find. Um, this, is a, this is a design team project, um, and I'm using the anniversary and the uh, gilded tapestry. Um, Oh, maybe that blue one. There's a blue one on that. So if you go over to line.arrow and you look up Gilded Tapestry um, and the Anniversary Digital, I, I'll show these um, when I go to do my next video. Um, I just, uh, let's do this. Let me cut this one out. I think a blue butterfly will be nice. Okay, so let me quickly fussy cut this. Take my glasses off. I'm so glad that these worked out because I've not done altered pu puzzles in a long time, but I've never um, done them as paper clips. So that was new. Um, yeah. Oops. Get in a little bit closer there, Sean. There we go. You know what? I don't think I'm going to be able to keep its little. 
little things. They're so tiny that, uh, yeah. Sometimes, like the antennas and things, you have to just let them go. Just let them go. Okay. Yeah, that'll look cute on there, but now we need to. Um, this one I'm going to look, again, I'm going to do it a little bit different. I'm going to put, I'm going to have it, um, put some threads underneath him. So I'm going to start out similar. Oh, sorry. I got a new mat, as you might be able to tell. I did not uh, say that in my, um, I realized after I made the video of my recent um, Happy Mail and uh, thrift store haul that um, I forgot to mention I got a new mat. So trying to uh, not be loud with it, but it's so awesome. It's glass. Uh, well, not, you know, it's tempered glass. It's it's by We Are Memory Keepers, and it just wipes up so easy. Um, I can do mixed media and my journaling all at the same time. I don't like that. I like that tail. So let's, um, but it is glass, so I can't be throwing things down on it. <laughs> uh, that will definitely annoy you guys. Don't want to cut off too much. Um, I like I like it to be a little bit stringy, um, as you can see. Okay, I think this should be perfect. Okay, and then yeah, I like that. Let's cut off this little bit of top here. There we go. There we go. Okay, so that's that, and I'll cut off the extra string when we're done. Um, so we're gonna start it the same way. Should we put lace on here? Hmm. You know what? Let's put some of. Oh, let's see. Maybe we'll put a piece of that Vandra lace that she sent me. That's over here. I haven't put it away yet. It's gonna go in this bag. That's why. Um. Let's cut off a little piece of this. Let's see how we like it. Oh, I do. Okay. And then I want to put in um, like a little nesting. I want to put a little nesting on here. And sorry about this. So I'm going to get some of my string bits. And Okay, like that. And now it needs, and then if, oh well, then if I put the little dots or the little nouveau drops, that might be enough. Okay, so let's go ahead and I'm just gonna pick it all up. We're gonna get right to it. Okay, then we got to pull up the lace a little bit. Put that down there. Come on. There we go. Put a little drop under this nesting. her it on there. Oh, let me just quickly ink the butterfly. I can't wait to share with you guys what I'm doing with the journals now. Uh, 
yeah so that'll be coming soon different than what I've done because you know I was getting my feet wet okay that looks cute let's cut off all these extra bits that are too much Now we will, um, all that. There, we're not putting any dangle on this one. So I am going to put little drops now. And that's it, I think. Um, you know what? Maybe, oh, let's put, maybe we should put a word on this one. Let's do that. Where is my, haha, let's put a Timmy word on it. Um, brave. Fly is too obvious. Um, I like brave. Possibilities too long. We'll do inspire. That's a good one. Oops. Okay. And then let me ink this up a little bit. Just ever so lightly. I don't like to um changing the way I ink and as much and I don't ink as much. Like I you guys will see. I'm got a different kind of way. Okay, then let's do this. I hope this inspires you guys to give this a try. Go to the dollar store or your thrift store um, and pick up a puzzle. Now, the, I, when I was looking, I was looking one for one with slight, with bigger pieces, um, not the normal tiny ones. Um, so that's what you... Okay, press that down. Oh, I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Okay, now... Let's see. Let's let's see how I like these dots. Yes. Oh, pr pretty, 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 pretty. Well, that's a small little dot. That's okay. Um, oh, we should put maybe we should put a pearl in the middle of the butterfly. That would be kind of pretty, huh? I want to make this one a little bit bigger. There we go. It matches the other ones. Okay. And yeah, let's put a flat back pearl on the butterfly. Why not? Okay. Oh my god. I've got a mess because I pulled out all this stuff. I wasn't sure what I was gonna use today. And I was like, OMG. Okay, let's put one of these tiny little flat back pearls on there. Um, After I unlock my glue. Because I, I forget to put my little blue caps on every time I use it. So that's why it keeps, um, yeah. If I would remember to put the cap on, which is easy because now I got these new bottles. I shouldn't. See, right away put it back on. And then you're okay. Oh, where's my... Oh, my tool is not here. Okay, I'm going to do it by hand, hopefully. Get this in there. Hello. Oh, I might have to get my tool out. Oh, geez. Geez, Louise. Let's see if I can do it with my... Just a pen. There we go. I don't want to get up and um, get the little... I have a little sticky tool. Ugh. That is perfect for these. And 
so I need to bring it down to my desk so I don't have to try to find it. a little bit. I need a mess. Okay. Here we go. Yeah. Okay. There's that one. Oh, I forgot to turn off autofocus again. I'm so sorry, guys. So that is my three um, Instagram inspired puzzle piece, ultra puzzle piece paper clips. Um, let me know if you give it a try. Again, I'll show them. This is the first one I did. It was a sample. And then we did these two together. I think, I think they're cute. I like them. They're going to look good in the journal. Yep. Here's the other one. So give it a try. Let me know. I uh, hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you guys in the next video. Love you. Bye.